From the figure, an isosceles triangle is inscribed in a circle, if AC equals BC which is 10 cm and AB is 12 cm, find the area of the circle. First let's draw a perpendicular line from C to pass through O, to line AB. Let's call the point of intersection P, recall that the radius of a circle that is perpendicular to a chord, bisects the chord. Now notice from the figure that the perpendicular line bisects the chord AB. Because it passes the center. And this follows that, AP equals BP which is equal to 6 cm, considering triangle APC, we are going to apply Pythagoras' theorem to find CP. From Pythagoras' theorem. AC square equals AP square plus CP square. AC is 10 cm, AP is 6 cm, and CP is unknown. Substituting these values in the formula, it follows that, 10 square equals 6 square plus CP square. 10 squared is 100, and 6 squared is 36. So 100 is equal to 36 plus CP square. To find CP, we collect like terms. It follows that CP square equals 100 minus 36. 100 minus 36 is 64, so, CP square equals 64. Next we take the square root of both sides. Doing so will give us, CP equals square root of 64 which is 8 centimeters. Before we proceed, please subscribe to my channel to encourage me to make more videos. Thanks. Next we draw a straight line from A to O. From the figure we know that CO is the radius of the circle, so let's label line CO, R. AO is also the radius of the circle, let's also call it R. Since CP is 8 cm, O, P will be 8 minus R. Now considering triangle AOP which is also a right angle triangle we will also apply Pythagoras theorem to find R. From Pythagoras theorem. AO, square equals AP square plus OP square. From the figure. AO is R. OP 8 minus R. And AP is 6. Substituting these values in the formula will give us. R square equals 6 square plus 8 minus R square. Expanding, 8 minus R square will give us 64 minus 16 R plus R square. Substituting 8 minus R with this value will give us R square equals 6 square plus 64 minus 16 R plus R square. 6 square is 36. Which follows that R square equals 36 plus 64 minus 16 r, plus r square. Next, we collect like terms. The r square on the right side will go to the left side to become negative since it is positive. So, r square minus r square, equals 36 plus 64, minus 16 r. r square minus r square is 0, and 36 plus 64 is 100, and we are left with. 0 is equal to 100 minus 16 R. Next, we take minus 16 to the left side. Minus 16 will become positive since it is negative. Doing so will give us, 16 R equals 100. To find R, we divide both sides by 16. 16 divided by 16 will leave us with R, and 100 divided by 16 is 6.25. Hence, the radius R of the circle is 6.25. Now we have known the radius of the circle, let's go ahead and find the area. Recall that, area of circle is pi times R square. Where pi is approximately 3.14. Substituting the value of radius in this formula, will give us. Area of circle equals 3.14 times 6.25 square. Which is the same as 3.14 times 6.25 times 6.25.
which is approximately 122.66 cm square. Hence, the area of the circle. Please subscribe to my channel to encourage me to make more videos, thanks.